This is a Windows Phone 7 game review of Parachute Panic, which is an Xbox Live title and available in the marketplace for $2.99. And the load speeds in this game aren't actually that bad. I won't even cut through anything here. So this is a really simple, yet addicting game. You play with these little parachute guys that jump out of planes, and you have to kind of control the wind, and try to make him land on the boat down here. The music in the game is fabulous, and it's just really calming and just, I don't know, kind of kind of like zen-like almost. So you have to tap the parachutes there sometimes. Other times they'll actually come down with the parachute already on, like that guy. But then you have to control the wind here and kind of give a little wind gust so that he lands in the right spot. And sometimes there's helicopters like those. If the helicopter hits your guy, then the blades will chop him to pieces. So you have to tap on it five times in normal mode, or three times in easy mode. And there's also that doodle jump character there sometimes. And that gives you extra points. So you try to get as high of a score as possible. Sometimes those alien ships will try to abduct your people, too. And there's also those rain clouds there, which will strike your person with thunder. So as you can see, you have lives up here, and you can get more lives by getting higher scores. And it's explained in the help section how all those scores will work. And you can also get those fish there which will give you um, some more points, or sometimes they'll give you back a life if you lost one. And there's plenty of other gameplay changing elements, like you see I just got struck by lightning. The visuals are really simple, but they're pretty fun. And as I said, the music is just super impressive. The gameplay is just simple yet addicting. And the controls are really good for what it is. The game is and so when you lose, you get your high score there, and it says how uh, much more you beat your last score by. And it has this cool music at the end. Like I said, the music is just really great. And also in the main menu there, you can look at your achievements here which adds some nice replayability. Like there's some achievements for, um, what, destroying 50 helicopters, dying in every way possible in a single game. Um, I know there's getting 20 taps on the little doodle jump guy that falls down, finishing with a score of zero. <laughs> and then you get zero gamer points for that, that's funny. Grabbing 100 fish with your parachutes, stuff like that. So those add nice gameplay, replayability. And you also have the leaderboard, so if your friends are playing this game, you can compete with them. You can even suggest them to buy this game. And there's not much else in the help and options, just shows you how to play, and how all the things work, like how you can control the wind, and the hazards like these, and it says you can get rid of those helicopters and aliens by tapping them five times in normal mode, and you can look at your statistics too. So you can see your scores there and how many things have killed you. As you can see, most of my guys have died in the water, and then the helicopter there. So overall, it's pretty cool. It definitely won't last you a long time, since there's only two game modes, and they're both basically the same, just slightly tougher. But it's still pretty fun. And it's a nice game just to pick up and play for a few minutes when you're bored. And the graphics are so simple, yet pretty fun for a little mobile game. 
The sound effects are what make this game really incredible. Just this music that's playing in the background right now. Fabulous. Just like calms you down and it's very peaceful. As you can see, I got a little bonus for catching that fish. If you think Parachute Panic looks like a good game to you, you can pick it up in the marketplace for $2.99. The game is over! It's not forever. Try it again. I can't believe it! Game try to save us all.